Hi, my name's Scott Lawrence. I thought I'd just show you a uh, little project I've been working on tonight, just a kind of exploration kind of thing. Um, each of these little guys here is a, uh, it's a stepper motor controller. Inside of it, it's an Atmega 168 uh, microcontroller. And uh, in uh, a blog post I link to down below in the description, um, I reverse engineered them and I put the Arduino bootloader on them and uh, can program them using the Arduino interface. Um, on them is a, a little program that takes in uh, serial and sends out serial. Um, like if it receives the number uh, 5, it'll turn off the light for 5 seconds and then turn the light back on and then send down a 4. So it'll always send down one less. And then uh, what I've got here also is, um, if you notice, I have one FTDI interface going to the computer going to the first one and then coming out of that is this cable which is just power and serial out so the serial from here RS-232 goes into this guy, well not RS-232 because it's uh, TTL level but you get the idea and then the transmit from this guy goes to the next guy's receive and then his transmit goes to this guy's receive and this transmit goes to here and so on so this guy send it a 5, it turns off the light for 5 seconds, sends down a 4, which goes here. This one goes out for 4 seconds, sends down a 3, which goes here, sends down a 2, and a 1. So, what I got here is a uh, uh, serial interface, and I'll type down a 5. When I hit return, you should see... One, two, three, four, five, then the next one goes out. One, two, three, four, and then this one. One, two, three, and one, two, and then one. And I also just uh, put in a thing. If I send a B, they all blink simultaneously. The B just turns off the light, sends down the B, turns, uh, waits quarter of a second turns it back on. So they, the first one that I was showing you um, has a delay involved between when it sends down the next byte to the next one, whereas the B, it sends it down simultaneously to all of them so that you can send a command down. So the plan is with this that uh, I'm going to be using this as the basis for a, uh, a protocol for the um, the animatronic bird project that I'm working on, where each of these will have, you can figure, pretend that each of these is a controller inside of one of the tiki birds. Um, so I could send down, say, uh, 15 bytes of data, three of which go to the first one, boop, and then this will take off the three bytes it needs and sends down the remaining 12, which go here, then this takes off the three bytes that it needs, sends the remaining 12, uh, uh, nine down to here and so on so each of them will take off the chunk of data that belongs to them um, this way none of these need to be specifically addressable they can all have the same program I don't have to say or program this one and say its ID number is four and this one's ID number is five and so on um, all I have to do is just have everything in the right order in this serial daisy chain and format the data to be in the right order as it gets sent down. So um, this was something I wasn't sure was going to even work, um, splitting up the transmit and receive for the UART so that it just kind of chains down. Uh, yeah, but apparently it uh, it does in fact work. So, so yeah, bonus. So yeah, that's it. Just a simple little project. Um, there'll be a link in the description for a uh, blog post for this guy. In case you want the uh, the program or whatever, um, yeah, that's it. Have a great day. Bye.